let's get crafting. Pretend you didn't love it. You want vengeance too. I did what I had to do. We've come too far to second guess ourselves, and we can't let anyone get in our way. Nice one, Binta. Ha! Huh, not bad. Yeah, I think we've given Binta a bit of a taste for combat. Did you get the bucket? Right here. Good luck up there. I'm going to check on my people. You're welcome back here when this is over. Thank you, Jesse, for everything. Okay, all strapped in, fireworks ready. need to Oh perfect just what I needed ah, too slow dummy come at me ugly Uh oh Whew, that was close Okay time to get the others I'm glad to see that waterfall. Yeah, we were getting 
getting kind of nervous down there. Sorry, the welcoming committee was a little strict. Come on, let's get inside. Okay, I'm not the only one that finds all this silence freaky, right? This place is dead. Definitely strange. Though I imagine you might be relieved to have a little quiet right now, huh? I was almost expecting, I don't know, another huge boss battle or something when we got in here. Yeah, the admin definitely seems to like those. But nothing. Yeah, after everything we've been through trying to get in here and take the admin's powers, having a teeny bit of a break is kind of nice. I thought so too. Ocelots. Lucas! Looks like the tables have finally turned, huh, Jesse? We can't let you keep doing what you're doing. That's enough now. Whoa, sorry. Guys, Lucas, I think you're confused. It's me! Oh, we're not confused. We know exactly who you are. Now, hang on, everyone. No. It's our turn to talk. Not yours. Not anymore. I reformed the Ocelots because I wanted to remind everyone of how things were before. And most of all, I wanted to remind you. No, Because but... the Jesse I know wouldn't be running around on some power trip locking people up. Lucas. So yeah, I set your prisoners free. What are you going to do about it? Yeah, and telling us our builds were ugly. Well, I am so glad you guys are all free. I didn't do any of this. What are you talking about? You were laughing, gloating, as you teleported people away. Everything you think I've told you since I came back from the Ice Palace was a lie. The admin locked me in a prison underground, took my identity, came back here, and pretended to be me. That is... No. How do we know this isn't a trick? No trick, friend. And it's not the first time. My friend Voss... The admin did the same thing with him. Yeah, we saw the whole thing. Is this really true? All those horrible things you did that... Okay. Yeah. It's you. Well, now that we have that sorted out... What in the world are we gonna do next? Wait, why are you even in here? We're trying to get to something called the terminal. We have a word of passage. <laughs> Potato. That we can apparently use to take away the admin's powers for good. Yeah, a lot of that was way over my head, especially the potato, but I'm in. You just lead the way, and the new ocelots will have your back. <laughs> well, would you look at this. Romeo's quite the Jesse memorabilia collector. I know we don't have much time, but it might be smart to suit up properly. Agreed. But that could be the admin's bane, too. Do this, Dragon's Bane. Now you look like you're ready for a showdown. Agree. Oh, thanks, guys. Time to end this. Ocelots! Oh! Okay, if 
I were a terminal, what would I look like? Why, hello there. Wasn't expecting you. Oh, crud. What's the move here, Jesse? Maybe you're confused, but this is my office. Heard there might have been people trying to break in, so... Here I am. Hang on, let me try and reason with him. Uh, hello? Jesse? It's over, admin. We're here to... Excuse me, excuse me, we? What? Where are they? Where'd they go? Oh, I am so upset that you're back. That wannabe ninja, Ivor, told me you were dead. Hearing that made me feel great. This? This makes me feel... Ugh, bad. Guess it was just a temporary case of death. Oh, you smug, arrogant, insignificant. What, pray tell, are you hoping to accomplish by challenging me? I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm just a touch more powerful than you. I know. That's why I'm not here to fight you. I want to talk this over. Jesse, uh, Jesse. Ugh, talking it out? What's the point in that? That's what losers do. Real people, awesome people, settle their differences with... with... Combat! Dueling! Build-offs! Sounds like that's the perfect thing for us to be doing, then. Loser. Did you... Really? Seriously? I'm having a hard day, too, you know! <sighs> well, you know what? It's just as well you're back. Because being Jesse is the worst! Oh, yes! Yes, I said it! I hate being you! Your, your people, your friends, they're so needy, so clingy! I have to listen to their stupid voices day after day after day, just asking for things. I, mean, I, I thought being Jesse meant that people would do what I wanted to do. No one ever asks what I want! Ah, oh, it's all, can I have iron and can I have gold? Well, I'm back now. I, I, I could help you take back over. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I suppose you could. Yeah. It's just... But it was fun at first. I show them some super amazing display of my awesome powers. They'd laugh. I'd laugh. But soon they were just asking me to do that all the time. You know, you know what's funny? You've made me see something. I mean, it's starting to feel like maybe I should just leave being Jesse to you. You know? <laughs> the, the, the genuine article. <laughs> yeah, but maybe that is the best way to proceed. I'm really glad you think so, because I think that's a good idea. Oh, thanks, Jesse. I appreciate that. Well, this has all been terribly enlightening, and I, I think we've all learned some great lessons here that I will totally remember for next time. Next time? Yeah, the, the next world I build after I bedrock over yours. Oh, I'm going to get it totally right with that one. No! A whole new set of people. A whole new world. Oh, I'll be a great leader, a great friend next time around. I should thank you for all these, these wonderful little lessons you've helped me to learn. Oh, maybe, maybe I'll have more fjords in the next one. Now hang on a second, Romeo, we can still be friends. You don't have to bedrock over anything. Yeah? You, you really think so? Yes! Mm, nah, bedrocking time. Oh well, toodles! This doesn't seem good. Oh, you guys are okay. Yeah, he just blipped us back to the hallways again. Such a... Whew, such a jerk.
take his powers away. Find the terminal space. The roof. That's where the admin keeps his portal to the terminal thing. Go. Come on. We need to get to that portal before the bedrock closes up. We're here. Yeah, but we don't know where here is. Is that the clock from the admin's tower? Yeah, <clears throat> I mean, uh... I, uh, found the Colossus. The trip down memory lane is nice and all, but how do we find the primary terminal thingy? There is so much stuff in here. Yeah, kinda hard to make sense of it all. Uh huh, well, it's the admin's place, right? So what would he do? He'd probably know where he was going, so... Admin protocol initiated. It's him! No, oh, it's just more of his stupid recordings. You've selected admin protocol. Oh, it's like a automatic assistant or something. Welcome to Terminal Space. Well, shall we? So, wait, he has this whole assistant thing set up, but only he ever comes here? The automated personal assistant system was developed to aid the mighty admin in menial tasks and help his friends navigate the terminal space. Man, so when he first made all this, he was still hoping his friends would come here too. Kinda makes me feel bad for him, actually. to begin a new program. I... That was all over my head. Password, password, password. That must be the word of passage. Hashtag potato451. Sounds like progress, right? It's empty? Waiting for material request. I mean, it must be talking about the potato, right? Sounds right to me. Uh, potato? Please? Acquiring potatoes! 
Items dispensed. Thank you! Wait, two potatoes? Yeah, a normal one and a poisoned one. Which one do we use? I mean, the word of passage didn't say anything about poison. But it did have that weird hashtag thingy. That might mean something? Oh, I don't think that symbol ever actually means anything. Hmm. Got to figure out which one is correct. And there we go. Was that a good thud or a bad thud? It's... Fred? Sara, hi. If you're seeing this recording, well, I guess the worst has happened. And you just put the word of passage into the primary terminal. I wish the terminal could just take away Romeo's admin powers. It'd be easier that way. But making this gauntlet was the best I could do. Put your hand into the pedestal to receive the gauntlet. It's got the power to make Romeo... normal again. It might take a few hits to remove his powers entirely, but it'll get the job done. Do you understand? Then good luck, Sara. You're... Well, I think you might need it. Well, here goes nothing. What do you think you're doing? What's happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo, once and for all. I told you, your world's done. No take that. <laughs> Jesse, hurry. Temple? Kalu Kale, Jesse. Remember when we first met? Oh. That was back when I thought we could still be friends. Huh. Figures. This temple, this challenge, was my first gift to you. Now, it's going to be where I bury you. Come on! I certainly can't! 
hope you're enjoying this trip down memory lane as much as I am. Everything you've done. Don't you judge me! You don't 
don't get to judge me! Give me the... That's all that! That's the cause of all this! Let go! Through, Admin. It's over. You can say that again. How's that level playing field feel, huh, Jerk? Get away from me! make everything so difficult. Everyone likes you, and you're nothing. Hey, we're not the ones trying to rule the world. What? No, no, I'm not. I just... Uh, I just wanted people to... Uh, is held together by my powers. No more powers. No more terminal zone. <laughs> We're doomed. We're gonna get buried if we don't get out of here pronto. What about him? What about him? He's not our problem anymore. But look at him. He'll never make it out of here on his own. Oh, she's right. Just... just leave me. My powers are the cause of all this in the first place. I deserve to stay here and pay for the mess I made. I can't believe that, that this is what it took for me to realize. Oh, I've been just so stupid, so blind. That's not up to you. You've hurt a lot of people. Well then, what, what are you going to do with me? Jesse, now's the time. We gotta go. Go on, leave me. I deserve to stay in this oblivion. You're not staying here. That would be the coward's way out. Come on.
Yeah, and not a minute too soon. Oh my gosh! It's not to following me, right? Right? Nah, I think you're in the clear, Slim. Hey, nice work. Thank you. Sincerely. I hardly believe that I deserve to be here at all anymore. I do know what I need to do to make up for my crimes, though. I'm going to return to the underneath. Try to help all the people I left behind. Fix all the lives I... ruined. And I'm going to try and find Zara. See if I can't make things right between us. I mean, it doesn't make up for what I... What I did to Fred. But if I can heal things with Zara, well, it's something at least. And. and no more admin powers. Everything I do now will just be the normal way. I think you might want to stay away from her, Romeo. I honestly think she might just kill you if she sees you again. Well, then that's a risk I have to take. She's. sort of the only friend I have left. <laughs> Seems fitting that my only friend. Wants to kill me. Save the world again, huh? Doesn't that ever get old? Why, yes, thank you for noticing. Thought we'd fit in a light bit of world saving before afternoon pie time. Happy to see you all in one piece, too. Whoa, 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 whoa! Is that the admin? Is he. Don't worry, he's not the admin anymore. This is Romeo. Well, that's a relief. No more admins for me, thank you very much. I agree with that 112%, Blondie. But Jesse, after everything he did, do you... Do you really think he deserves to go free? What if he hurts more people? He might... He might have been better off where he was. Oh, he's free, but he's not going anywhere. He's gonna make up for all the bad stuff he's done. I foresee many, many hours of community service in his future. Like, thousands. What do you guys say we head home? I say, way ahead of you, friend. <laughs> me too. Man, I cannot wait to put on a shirt again. Approaching you from this direction, and am coming to speak with you. No ninja trickery, hijinks, or tomfoolery here. Both my actions and my intentions are crystal clear. Huh. I think I can hear Ivor, but I don't see him. I'm right here! Hello! Clearly in view! Oh, there you are. Hi, Ivor. Yes, hello. Hmm. So, no more Ninja Ivor, then? Ha! Huh. No, no. I decided it was time to stop running around in my pajamas and start trying to fix a few messes. Starting with trying to heal the rift between my old friends. Ellie will be easy. Just need to stop by Redstonia. Last I heard, Gabriel was doing the wandering warrior thing. Oh man, that's awesome. They're gonna be so excited. You think so? That's certainly the way I'm hoping it will happen. Well, I suppose it's time for me to go. This has been fun, though. 
hasn't it? Jesse! Jesse, hey! What's up, Radar? I was just saying goodbye to... Guess ninja habits die hard. I, uh, hope you don't mind, but uh, I've kind of been taking charge of the beautification project. I thought, why not at least make it look intentional? Really stepping it up to leader mode, if I do say so myself. And it's been stressful, but also fun. Well, you had a pretty great role model, if I do say so myself. Yeah, Lucas is an amazing guy. Joke. Whoa! Hey, Luna. Anyway, uh, so with Champion City gone, I was going to make Luna a new llama house and get her set up here in Beacon Town while I help out up there. But uh, before I did, I thought I'd uh, double check and see if you'd already been planning on, you know, uh, watching out for her. Seeing, you know, that she likes you so much and all. If you've already built her a llama house when I haven't been around, I, I, I just wouldn't want to double up. Which, by the way, I'd be okay with you doing if you'd already built one. I can tell you mean a lot to each other in your own weird ways. I wouldn't want to come between that. Yes, yes, that's true. I really am sorry for how I acted, Luna. How I treated you. And I hope that if you'll stay with me, you'll let me prove that I can be better. Oh, Luna, darling. I can't tell you how much this means. Oh. I do want to sincerely thank you, Jesse, for everything. You saw me at my worst, and you still thought I was worth saving. That, well, that makes me want to try to be better at being my best. Hoping I can start by helping clean up this dump. I guess our rivalry is over. Finally put it to an end. Actually, I ended our rivalry. I can end a rivalry way better than you. I'm not proud of it, Jesse, but I was a little tiny bit weirdly obsessed with you. Oh, are we talking about Stella being a weirdo stalker now? Hey, Stella and I were just talking about what a crazy road it's been. Yeah, no kidding. Yes, well, we need to be running. Oh, and thank you again. For everything. Now, you got everything you need. All packed and double-checked? Yes, Jack. This is very... I don't know. Bittersweet for me, you know. Goodbyes are... No good. Hey! Hmm... That we have, Nermi. So, I won't say it this time. <laughs> Not to people that I will see again. <laughs> you got it. Come on, walk me to the gate. So, you're leaving, apparently? For how long? Honestly, probably a while. But it's good this time. I'm doing it for me. I'm trying to, like, grow or whatever. Anyway, I'm about to say goodbye to everyone, and I ah! come here. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Promise oh, broken. Jeez, it'll be okay. So Petra's heading off into the great unknown, huh? <laughs> I figured. Definitely sounds exciting. Everyone's got to find their happy place. For Petra, it's mostly in unexplored forests and caves. Yeah. I think I'm closing that chapter of my life for a while. It's time to settle down. Here. Hey, you guys are missing out on prime group hug action. Ah! No air! Actually dying! Ah. <sighs> you don't think this is like the last time we'll all be together, do you? No. Well, maybe. I don't know. I mean, 
If Petra's leaving... Well, I mean, until the world needs saving again. That always seems to act as a nice reunion. Well, hopefully... Hopefully not too soon, though. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna get out of here before I... <laughs> too late. Bye, guys. Be safe out there, okay? The safest. And when you finish that book of yours, I better have a great part in it. Uh-huh. <laughs> Back in the admin's cabin, I, I know you promised that we'd always stick together. But the invite's still open if you want it. No pressure. Wait, you're leaving? Yeah, I think Petra and I are gonna hit the road for a while. Huh. Sounds pretty awesome, right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean it does, but, but without you here, who will run Beacon Town? Things are peaceful now, but danger could still strike at any time. Who do you think, pal? You! Me? Really? Yeah, I hereby promote you from intern to hero in residence. Thanks, boss. This, uh, you have been, you are. What I'm trying to say is that I promise I'll make you proud. You already have. Everyone's going to miss you, you know? And I'm going to miss them, too. But if anyone ever really needs me, I'll be around. you'd be interested in a race. 